Hey guys, it is not a new Monday, but it is a new week and I look like shit because I just stress like um, picked my entire skin. Ignore that. I also ignore my hair. Um, it's already Wednesday. Um, I just finished my work day. Work week, I should say. I have a holiday planned for tomorrow. <laughs> Supposedly, I'm going to Budapest tomorrow with some friends um, that I know from my ex exchange semester from when I studied in the US. We usually see each other like twice a year, but obviously due to COVID we haven't in like two years or so. Um, most of them are European by the way, so that's why it's quite easy for us to meet up. Um, but we booked this trip to Budapest a little, little while ago when things were looking up. Obviously things are looking not so up right now, so we doubted this whole situation, but we're all boosted now, and we're all willing to go but then bum 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 the unthinkable happened or not the unthinkable definitely the most thinkable situation but one of my roommates tested positive for corona and i was like <sighs> please i need to go on this trip for my mental health and for this friendship and uh, yeah um i've been walking around the house with a mask ventilating, cleaning, keeping him locked up. <laughs> so far so good, but then over the past few days I also heard that some people tested positive after this party I went to on Saturday, which I obviously should not have gone to, especially not for just before this trip, because that was a risk. Um, and that stressed me out. <laughs> It was just one friend group within the party that all tested positive, which is not my friend group. Thank god, they're nice people, but... <laughs> so yeah, that stressed me out even more. And then this morning I woke up and I wanted to do a self-test just in case. I don't even need a test to get into Budapest, but obviously I'm not, like, knowingly taking COVID into another country. And, um, <laughs> it's a very vague, positive line can you even see trust me the fuck out i had some nervous shits today <laughs> i did another test that came back clearly negative that confused the shit out of me and stressed me out even more because now i'm like what do i do i quickly booked a official test with like a government officials um that i had this morning and it was negative and i'm just so confused like i don't have any symptoms right now or head when i just got that positive test i was like do i have a cough is my throat hurting is this happening every time i think i have covid i get placebo effect and i actually get symptoms um but yeah nothing um so i'm still really confused i'm really happy but i'm also really confused i think i'm gonna do another one of those official ones tomorrow morning just to be sure and then i'm like okay i want to go um so yeah i guess i can start packing my bags though but i have so much to do i need to wash my hair i need to change my bedding i need to pack my stuff shave head to toe <laughs> it's gonna be a long evening <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is going to be the last bit of vitamins and greens I'm going to have for about a week because it's all just going to be booze and burgers probably. <laughs> so we got a big ass salad with spinach, red onion, cucumber, bell pepper, tomatoes, feta cheese and apple. Yum. Here's to testing negative and staying positive. So cringe but so excited to go. Why is there two helicopters over there? Anyways, um, it is 2.30. I'm waiting for my friend Chris to arrive. She's gonna pick me up and she's gonna drive us to, to the airport. 
and we're, meet we're actually flying from Eindhoven, which I've never flown from before. I did land there once, so yeah, that's happening. And then we're meeting up with our friend Linne, who is coming from another part of the country. And us three are flying to Budapest, Budapest today, or this evening. It's now almost three, and we're flying at like 5.30. Um, and then the rest of the group is flying in tomorrow. We're only missing one person, which I'm really sad about. At least one of the Europe the only European left. I normally don't include our Asian and American friends because obviously we can't and always meet up with them. That's just a bit too much to ask for. This sounds really rude. <laughs> we try to meet up with them, obviously, but the main part of our group is European, and that's why we're able to meet up quite often. But yeah, I am sad Alice is not joining us. But nonetheless, I'm very excited to go on this trip. I haven't talked to you in a few hours, but we made it to Budapest. Hey, Dayo, are you going to vlog? Zeker. Is it? I look nog wel eens vlogjes op van jou. Yeah? Yeah. Um, we ended up. Oh, we zijn er weer in de vlog. Look how freaking terrifying this is. Uh, but yeah, we're just here for one night. 9:30. <laughs> Show me your burger. Oh, interesting. <laughs> Come on, bad. My ace from the clip. Do you open up a? Okay. <laughs> oh, we just had dinner at this. What was it? Gluten-free, lactose-free lactose -free. place. Oh. Perfect for us. The gluten-free girl, <laughs> the allergy girl. Over walking. Allergy <laughs> walking. <laughs> Jawel. Um, and then we had some drinks at this other bar, but apparently we got kicked out of the restaurant because we didn't realize it closed at 10, which was really awkward and I hate being the last customer. And then we also got kicked out of the bar, which closed at 12, but we weren't the last customer. We're walking home right now. It's kind of snowing, I don't think you can tell. It's really freaking cold and it's around 12. We're just gonna go to bed at a decent time we need to check out at 10 and then tomorrow we start meeting up with the rest of our group i think kieran is the first who will meet at like 12 ish so we'll see what's happening tomorrow i'm just really cold oh over the annoying dutch people who scream um why is there a Dutch flag hanging here? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> it is Friday and Linne wants to do a room tour. <laughs> no. Um, we just stayed here for one night. It's a really small room. Or not small, huh? Welcome to our friends. Chris and Linne showed this bed. This was my bed. I had the bed to myself because I snore. He. <laughs> And then we had a little bathroom just for this one night though. I just w we woke up and I was wearing my bonnet and Chris uh, goes, Girl, you're so cold. Why are you wearing a beanie? <laughs> but the sun is out. We haven't seen uh, Budapest in daylight yet. So we're excited. Oh my God. I haven't seen blue skies in forever. So we're going to go find breakfast and meet up with the rest. Coffee, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yummy, yummy. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> nice. Nee, ik ga me dan. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, Ali. Hello, I almost didn't make it. I've had an awful day. Typical. <laughs> yeah, yeah. How does it feel to be on camera again? Oh my god, I'm so excited. Yes, are you? Grace and Anthony, which one of them? Hey. I'm not even gonna try. Hi, Beth. Fuck off. <laughs> she hates the camera. Hey, Wolfgang. Hi. What do you It is the... Sun! Well, yeah. Sun. 
done. It's the next day. What day is it? <laughs> One second in the sun. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> Nobody wants to be in the video. You have to scream. One second. <laughs> How was your hangover? So nice. <laughs> I'm enjoying it. Do you, are you hangover? Yes. Why, why yes. not? But the good thing is, it's too cold outside, so my headache's starting to. Yeah, it's yeah. just it's nice. gone. Yeah. The weather is nice. It's really cold, but I'm wearing tights underneath my pants. It's the smartest decision I've ever made in my life. That is pretty, just like Bath is. I'm actually sharing so my scarf from here. Yes. Adam, because it's it so long, it's like a blanket. My and ears are gonna drop off. Yeah. Huh? My ears are literally gonna fucking drop off. It's <laughs> cold. This is insanely pretty. We're diving in. I assume so. Um. It's already like 9 p.m. We walked around the city for a really long time. I look really bad because. Um, at one point we were starving, had lunch really late in this Jamie Oliver restaurant, which was really good. Walked back home and we all crashed and um, we were planning on having dinner in a restaurant, but we cancelled our reservation because we all fell asleep. But we're now getting ready for the evening again and we ordered takeaway. Some of us have curry, some of us have vegan food and we're playing games. Yay! Yum! What's that? That looks really good. I ordered vegan ranch. Oh yeah. I'm on a fuck off diet. What? <laughs> Rude as fuck. Cut the cameras. Dead end. <laughs> I need to drink all of these against them too. <laughs> this is not fair. Here we go. <laughs> Say hi. One second <laughs> Day three or four, I don't know, lost my voice. It is 6.30. What did we do today? <laughs> Swimming. Yes, we went to the therm baths, I guess. Sauna. Nice experience. Even though I got an Watching allergic... Watching half naked Bulgarian men. Chef's kisses. Bulgarian, we're in Hungary. <laughs> <laughs> well, they were probably there as well. <laughs> I was like, uh, yeah, it was nice. And now we're going out for dinner, which will be the last dinner with all of us because Wolfgang is going home very soon. Enjoy. <laughs> I really want some miso soup. Can I have one last second with Wolfgang in it? Chris, the fuck you, man. <laughs> was that you one second ago? Beth is scared of the camera. <laughs> five years. Not five years, this somewhere. <laughs> this is my voice, four days in Budapest. Not very good. I just realized this vlog is like so over the place. I look really bad. <laughs> I feel fine. Yesterday we went to a spa which was really good. Got all zen. And then we had dinner. 
and um, Wolfie left us already after two nights, so that was kind of sad. Like my friends are laughing at me for vlogging, but um, we were then deciding if we wanted to go to a bar or just go home, and we ended up with the ladder, which I'm happy about because I went to bed at 10, and I slept like a baby, so that was amazing. But I should stop talking now. <laughs> It's just, oh, the lack of sleep and the screaming in clubs is not doing great things for me. This is our last full day. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna go out for some food and blah 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 I actually should turn off this vlog or shut down or end it because it's the end of the week. It's actually the start of the new one. Is it Monday? It is. So, I'm just gonna say, since it's the end of the week, which means it's the end of the vlog. What, what, what do I usually say? I don't know. It's the end of the week, which means it's the end of the vlog. If you like this, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. It's completely free. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. <laughs>